Hello, everybody. It's I from Eyes Munchies. Uh, thank you very much for joining me for the live stream again. And today I will be making vegetable soup. Yes. Well, today is on the 22nd of January and it's 1.30 in the afternoon in Japan. It's, it's, it's really um, amazing that I'm actually starting on time, just on time. So, hello, Simon. Thank you very much for waking up for me. <laughs> oh, hello, Ken. Hello. Wow. I hope you guys are great. Hi, Night Rider Girl. Thank you very much for joining me. I'm just so happy to see you. Yes. I'm just wondering, how are you? <laughs> I know, Ken. It's 5.30 in the morning in Norway. Thank you so much. I really appreciate your time and your energy. My goodness, I don't... Oh, hello, y Yari Pap. Oh, you're from Cyrano. Oh, I see. I've been to... Oh, yes, I know. It's 5.30 in the morning also in Belgium. Oh, my goodness. Thank you. I really appreciate your time and energy. Yes, and um, yes, I've actually been to Seattle, to be honest. Um, I don't know if you ever heard that. Hello, Merry Christmas. Oh my goodness, it's been a while. Hi, Merry Christmas. Okay, um, great, great, great. Wow, 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 wow. Thank you. Yeah, and your response is just so quick, so... Oh, that makes me just so exciting. Yes, thank you. Yes, yes, you're up early in the morning. Thank you, though. Okay, um... Well, I... I don't know if you've heard of me, about me, was in New York, living in New York, actually, uh, working in New York. Uh, I don't know how many years ago, maybe more than 10 years ago. And uh, yes, in at that time, um, I went to Seattle because of maybe, 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 um, a f yes, yes. Oh, that's where you are. Merry Christmas. I see. Oh, hi, Craig. Hello, it's 11.30 p.m. Oh, thank you, thank you. It's, it's a re really late night. Oh my goodness, everyone from the world, I'm just so happy to hear all of you guys. Wow, great. Well, hi, Chris. Great, hello, hello, hello. Yes, well, one time, when I was doing a live stream with um, Shinichi and he actually told everyone <laughs> my background <laughs> at the time. So, um, yeah, I know. It's just so wonderful that how, you, how we can get together like in the world. This is just so great. Yes, I know how great it is. Wow, that's why this is just so addictive. Oh my goodness, Tonkatsu King. Yes, good afternoon, good evening, hello. Okay, well, um, then, then um, yes, I mean, I wasn't really hiding or anything, but I just, I don't, I don't know. I wasn't really expecting that Shinichi was going to tell you guys, um, yes, very naughty. <laughs> I wasn't really naughty or anything, but she, he really uh, told everyone that uh, why I was in New York and, you know, things like that. But never mind, because of, you know, he told you already. So some of you might have known that uh, why I was in New York, because I was um, a reporter, like a sport or like sport baseball reporter and uh, I was actually following Yankees so I was there like uh, every game that you know New York Yankees did so but basically I was actually following Japanese players like Godzilla I don't know some of you know Godzilla Matsui Matsui Hideki and at that time 
well, he's yeah, still still um, Ichiro is there. So, um, yes. Oh, oh, really, Ken? So the baseball major league is only sport you follow. Okay, well. I'm not really following anymore, but at that time, because that was my job, and uh, that's why, you know, I was following all the Japanese baseball players, so Ichiro was going to have the world record, so uh, I, that's why I went to Seattle and report about Ichiro. And that was kind of exciting in a way, but I mean, besides baseball, it was just fun to just go around in America, that was, you know, it's, it's really worth um, having those uh, jobs. So um, I really enjoyed it. And then uh, it was the great time to actually get to know America more because um, I think basically, I, I, I think I had a really wrong idea of America. So, um, did I meet Ichiro? Yes, I did, because I had to interview him. And he was a very, very difficult person in a way. I mean, once you get to know him or once you you really study about him or to, to be curious very much about him, then he, he can be really curious about the reporters. But otherwise, you know, if you think of like, this is the business or like this is my work to do so if you feel that way then he wouldn't really care about anybody you know that's that's what he is so in that way he's a really hurtful person that's what i thought so um it was very difficult for me because i just didn't really know about base baseball and then i was obviously studying a lot and uh, i got to know it but because of I haven't played baseball as a woman, I mean, as a woman, a girl. So it was kind of difficult to kind of, you know, approach him. But um, it was just, you know, great experience for me. Yes, baseball. Yes. Hi, I'm, I'm missing to say hello, damn it, damn it, damn it. <laughs> and... Uh, Josh Ali, yes, baseball, baseball, that's what I was talking about. Never mind. Well, Seattle actually reminded me of that all time, you know, my life when I was in New York. So, yes. Yes, Taguchi, yeah, Taguchi was there. But Ta when Taguchi went there, I was already back in Japan, so I, I couldn't actually follow him. So it was a shame. I, I, I'm I sure Taguchi should be a really nice person, right? Should be. I don't, I don't really know him. So the, the last person I could interview was uh, Mat Matsuzaka in Red, Red Boston, in Boston. Red, Red Sox in Boston, sorry, <laughs> Red Sox. Yes, yes. Hi, Clark Griffin. Griffith, sorry. I always say Griffith. Griffin, I'm sorry. I didn't mean it. Griffith. Great. Okay, well, today, uh, as I was telling you, um, I was going to make vegetable soup that can actually clean your fridge. Well, that's the kind of purpose. Yes, yes, Pasha is barking actually. I don't know. I think she just saw something out there. Uh, she's having a nice time in the corridor on the um, stairs. So it's that's the warmest place in this house. <laughs> she knows where she should be. Anyway, so uh, uh, again, I have to change, switch my camera to set up this is really bad isn't it i'm sorry i have to do this every time ho, ho, ho. okay okay then i can show you what's going on down here when i'm cooking so <clears throat> oh you love soup dim it great well i mean it sounds very very 
easy. I, actually, it's easy. I no, no, no. I mean, uh, it sounds very uh, boring, but it can. It, it really will turn out to be delicious. So, really wanted to show you how to do it. Okay. Great, so it's all ready. Hi, Victor Debs. Hello, how are you? Great. Okay, so um, I was going to uh, introduce St. Louis loves cooking and baseball here. Oh, that's great. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, I was gonna introduce all the ingredients. Um, in French, but I didn't actually have so much time for that. Enough time for that. I'm sorry. So I will do that the next time. But instead of that, I, I don't know. I I was saying, uh, you know, bonjour, comment ça va. <laughs> in the beginning of this live stream, I hope it worked. Okay. Well, um, and also I I can say, uh, je m'appelle I. <laughs> Okay, all right. Well, today uh, I will show you how to make fridge cleaner uh, vegetable soup. Ta -da! Okay, so actually, because I don't know, I was making uh, a lot of things like uh, earlier, so not today, but like earlier this week. Um, so Pepo67, hi, love, great to see you. Thank you, Nancy, Nancy Yan. Oh, did I say hello to Nancy Yan? Hello. <laughs> and, um, okay, well, that's what well, I was actually making a lot of things. And so that's why I have so many vegetables in my fridge right now. So, um, Maybe I'm just going to use like a many vegetables, but um, <laughs> and um, but I mean, whatever you have in your fridge is fine. I mean, in my recipe, there is no rule. I mean, so if you want to have something you want then that's just the add in that's that's the basic idea so first of all okay um okay so this is called kabu kabu japanese kabu so it's it's turnip turnip <laughs> in english this was the only one in english i didn't actually know turnip um oh hi Clayton Kato. Hello, aloha, hello. Okay, well um do you actually have this turnip kabu in your country that I was um wondering? Well if you don't, don't worry about it. I think I've seen something like this in red. But that's gonna work too. I mean, you don't have to have it. I mean, any visual you have in your fridge is fine. Okay. All right. And um, carrot, mushrooms, and I have bro broccoli. Broccoli. And pumpkin, tomato, tomatoes. Oh, <laughs> turn up. <laughs> it's like a turnip. I don't know, turnip, turnip, turnip. That's that's what I kind of searched. Am I saying right? If I was wrong, then please let me know. Yes, I want to know the uh, correct one. Um, oh, okay. You have some of the old carrot. That's old one is fine, really. Oh, thank you. Okay. Oh, okay, Joshua. Thank you. Turn it. And daikon radish. And this is the key point. I always wanted to have uh, letters, like a fresh letters for this, um, for this soup. 
Oh, hi, Pinyon. Hello. Great to see you again. Uh, Christian Hansen. Hello. Great. Okay, well, this is the, uh, the point, really. Um, every time I have this soup, I always wanted to have this fresh letters. I mean, I don't usually have uh, this letters for anything else, like even salad. I don't really like it because, you know, if, when I see this, this makes me feel like this is going to make my body really cold. So I wouldn't really get it. But for this soup, I mean, whatever you, I have the soup, I try to get this letter. So this is kind of my, my favorite thing. Okay, and um, sausages, sausages. Today I'm just gonna have sausages. But if you prefer to have bacon, that should be okay too. But I like this uh, sausages texture, then that's why I actually got sausages. Alrighty, that's it. Really, I also have um, potato, but I'm not quite sure if I really want to use this because, um, well, never mind. I'm just gonna use this anyway. Okay, potato. Okay, all right. So that's the kind of ingredients I have today. I mean, I would prefer to have onions because that's gonna make things really sweet, but Never mind, if you don't have it, that's that's it, really. Okay. Um, yes, I know, I know you actually use cabbage instead of like, yeah, anything else. So, um, what was I saying? <laughs> yes, but um, today, uh, so any anything you like to have, that's fine. I mean, I was actually thinking to get cabbage as well, but I don't need any more vegetables. So um, that was it really, I thought. Okay, so let's cut all the vegetables, okay? Doo -doo. Let's get started. Okay. The thing is, while I'm cutting, um, at the same time, the great thing is, um, I'm going to stir fry first. Stir fry all the vegetable first. That would make the soup very, very tasty. So um, I'm going to stir fry it first with this kind of iron kind of pan because of course I'm going to add uh, water later on, but um, first of all, I'm going to Oh, hi, Betty G. Hello, how are you? Thank you very much for um, joining me today. Well, today I actually making a soup, a uh, uh, fridge cleanup soup. So whatever you have the vegetables in your fridge, just put it all in the pan. So therefore then uh, you can clean up your fridge. Okay, uh, that's my purpose today. Okay, so, I'm just gonna not use water first. I'm just going to stir fry it, then uh, then steam it to to get all the the liquid from the vegetables first. Then add water. That's the kind of plan for this recipe. Okay. Uh, so as I'm going to cut the vegetables, I'm going to stir fry first. So, let's start anyway. <laughs> okay. All right, so I hope you can see all the, the things of what I'm doing that right down here. Um, I hope so. 
it's kind of messy around here because all the ingredients are here so first to get all the nice uh, broth liquid from the vegetables so I'm just going to cut uh, I don't know sausages but um, how you cut it is really whatever you like you can cut diagonally uh, you can cut like in the round I don't know. I don't know. This is gonna take a little while, so I'm just gonna cut di diagonally. Okay, and then put it in here. Okay. And uh, anything takes while to stir fry first, so I'm just gonna. Take a bit of skin of carrot to clean a little bit. Actually, this carrot is kind of old too, you know, Simon. So, so cleaning up your fridge by making this water work. Maybe I'm just going to cut in dice. It'd be nice, isn't it? Yes, I just remembered that um, when I was talking about soup, making soup, Tamara wanted to kind of know this recipe. So I thought it'd be nice. And uh, turn it. Okay. As you know, I don't want to waste any of it, so I'm just going to use this part too. But just make sure, clean it. all the dust but this is gonna take this won't take long time to actually um, cook it so I'm just gonna leave it there has all the nutrition between the skin and uh, the vegetable itself so um, I don't really like to take all the skin off but if you feel like not having those skins go ahead to take off okay so A little bit of oil, little bit, then start to stir fry. Do you 
actually take off the skin of this potato, do you? Hmm. I think for the potato, it might be nicer if you take the skin off, so... I'm just gonna take that off. Mmm, nice sound of stir frying. So beautiful day out there. I mean, as usual, uh, I went to um, walk with Boshe this morning. It was such a beautiful day. It was just like a spring kind of weather. See? If you have this like nice kind of not burning or anything nice you know brown kind of color that makes the taste really deep i like it Like a how many months ago? I don't remember. The last time I uh, went to my friend's house to cook, I brought my um, slicer with me, and I actually forgot it at his house, and um, I haven't seen them since then. So that was my favorite, favorite slicer. I'm missing it. It's so annoying. what I want. Great. And maybe the um, heat is a bit too high. Okay. Looks great. I like it. The, the, how you say, the broccoli, but the hard, hard part, I'm just going to cut it off the side, and to use this, the center part. Some people actually throw this part away, but this has so much nutrition, so make sure that 
going to use this part. And this is And uh, lastly, I'm going to put this pumpkin. A bit of it. But I wouldn't actually put this pumpkin now. I would have put it later, I think. Okay, well, then, tomatoes. Take this out and then cut it in half and put it in there and then that's it. This is going to make it really juicy, so this is what you need. Okay. Just get the lid on to make it to take out the of the um, take out the juice of the vegetables. Oh, then I'm going to cut this daikon radish as well. slice of the skin just a bit okay. wow it's got a so much visible so exciting So never mind. Alrighty, I have to wait for a little while from now. So, um, what was that? Bustle. Joshua Lee, a mixing pot of rope waters, not even a base yet. Looks yummy. Yes, that's right. Hello, Colbert. 
Hello, Corbett. Yes, it is actually taking a little while to make this soup. But um, yes, today I'm actually making soup, a vegetable soup. I know this is like a soup, but I'm actually, first of all, stir fry all the vegetables. Then that's gonna, you know, brings all the yummy part of vegetables um, as you stir fry. And I'm actually uh, putting a lid on so this pot. Then now the, the all the juice comes from the vegetable. Letting the vegetable, no, letting the vegetable to take off all the, the liquid stuff. <laughs> Am I saying it right? Um, so bad in that, my English. Mm -hmm. Well, this is going to take a little while, but it's little by little, all the juice coming out from the vegetables. I hope, um, I hope you understand it. And um, this is gonna, this is gonna turn out to be very yummy anyway. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Joshua. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> yes, it's, it's getting great. Then, uh, well, that's what I'm doing. Then when the liquid comes out, yes. Um, thank you, Nancy Yan. So, um, liquid salad, is it? Oh, hi, Nosha Bra. Hi, are you? Oh, I didn't know you were there. And then David Ma, yes. Um, a teaspoon of sugar? No, I wouldn't think so. Well, actually, to take, um, take out the liquid easier it would be add salt so i'm just going to put a little bit of salt so i'm just going to um add it though okay this is how it looks now and looking good right okay sprinkle the salt stir fry Mm, kind of nice and juicy a little bit. Mm, mm, mm. Well, as you cook it long enough, makes it really yummy. So um, later on, I'm gonna put white wine and consomme powder it actually got yeah thick soup yeah it's going to be thick soup well that's what i was actually uh worried about a little earlier because because if i put potatoes that's gonna make the soup kind of thicker i don't know if i really like it or not but um Never mind. If I stir fry it, it might be kind of nice. That's what I thought. So I actually add it. Hi, Tony. Hello. Hello, Tony. No, no, sorry. Troy. Troy. Latima. Am I going right? Am I saying right? Yes, that's right. <laughs> Sorry, I was just reading your... You know what? Because I can actually, you know, read all the, you know, the, the messages, all of your messages. That's why I was just so worried about my eyes. So, sorry, almost right. Okay, so Troy Latimer. Is it Latimer or Latimer? Or um, I'm just wondering. Yes, well, I don't know how you can tell me your pronunciation <laughs> of your name. Never mind. Oh, hello, hello, hello. Oh my goodness, so many people are here. Um, Ju Fashan. Ju Fashan. Hello. And a lady missed. Hello. 
Oh, okay. Um, Juhashan, yes. Juhashan, yes. Well, well, yes, I am actually, I, I, I am planning and I know what I'm doing, but um, every time, no, 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 I, um, every time I use, I make this vegetable soup, I don't usually put potatoes. That's the one thing I was kind of worried about. But uh, because the all you know the the theme of this recipe today is um, clean up your fridge. So I actually had a potato in my fridge. I was just wondering if I put it there, and then I was just worried about uh, getting the the soup. It's kind of thick. But never mind, like everything is great, um, whatever I do or whatever you do. So in that case, yes, I am trying today. So let's see how it goes, okay? So to be honest, this isn't my first time making this soup, but this is first time, well, not first time, but it's been a while. Uh, since the last time I put the potato in the soup. That's it. Uh, okay, well, yes, depends on what kind of potatoes. Yes, I think you're just pointing out a really good point. Um, David Marr. But just, just let's see how it goes okay so this is how it looks right now nicely juicy can you see this is what i wanted can you see the juice is coming out nicely mm. so basically if you really want to have the soup without the water you're just gonna keep just cooking with the, the lid but because I don't have that much time now and uh, I'm just gonna put white wine oops it'd be nice I'm going to add consomme powder. If you if you have like a cube of the consomme or whatever you have the broth, you just add it. Chicken stock is fine. Because I like the the, the consomme taste. I add this. Wow, looks already good. So I'd rather prefer to have all the, the, the liquid from the vegetables and white wine uh, instead of like all the you know water added. You know what I mean? So in this case, you don't have to add so much water because it's got to already have a liquid from the vegetables, which is much nicer taste. Now, I'm just going to add the water like this much. How is it? <laughs> Looks so yummy, huh? Okay. Looking so good. Then now I'm going to cut up 
all other vegetables. Hi, Boshe. Hi, Boshe. You came to say hello to everyone. <laughs> Are you? Okay. And broccoli. Well, this. Wouldn't take so much time to boil it, so maybe not. Still not now. It's a bit too early. Okay, so the broccoli is ready. Shall I just put this pumpkin? Yes, again, if I add a pumpkin, then that's going to make this soup very thick. That I know. But never mind. Because this is going to be nice and yummy winter soup. Doesn't it look very nice winter soup? I like it. Hmm. Well, this will take a little while. Well, I'd love to just leave it for another 20 minutes, but I don't have that much time, do I? Because I don't have that much time now, I'm just gonna add all the um, vegetables I have. Then, uh, the lid, put that it on. Okay, so at least I'm going to cook for another 10 minutes, shall I? Okay, great. Now, can you wait for another 10 minutes? Okay. Hello, Iris Rose. Hello, hello. my chair here, uh, then you can actually wait for the soup. All right, then I can see your, yes, yes, I was actually talking about my eyes, right? And then um, I was just worried about what's happening in my eyes because I kind of, have this eye problem, eyes problem that um, I can't really see, you know, your comments and you know, just so frustrating. So um, I went to the, the opti, what, 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 what is it? <laughs> oh, oh, what, what, what? <laughs> anyway, I went to see the doctor and then, um, uh, then really, uh, ask them to look 
my eyes and um optician yeah optician that's right <laughs> optimistic yes optimistic see i can't see it though optimetrists okay that's how you say it properly thank you very much yes i went to see it then uh they really really um look through all my eyes and uh <laughs> up to something yes and uh the result was nothing is really <laughs> am i all right yes i am thank you um nothing was really wrong with my eyes i mean like 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 the, the 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 size of my glasses is just just perfect and um <laughs> and uh um but i mean everything was just fine but well, what i have like contact lenses glasses like everything is just fine but the only one thing they just find out is because of like when when you when you are just seeing down here and then like closer then suddenly when you when you want to see something out there like really far away then the, the muscle in my eyes just doesn't kind of catch it fast enough so that's the kind of problem I have but never mind maybe that's like an age problem so I wouldn't really worry about it but the good thing was I don't really have that old eyes yet so that's one thing I'm just kind of relieved about so but anyway I can't really see your messages it's just so bad so I'm sorry if I didn't say it properly and then I'm so sorry about that. I apologize for us. Someone actually said hello, hello, hello. Tashi one chunk. Hello. Uh wow. Wow. Um have you ever been on my channel it's it's just nice to meet you thank you wow um every time i see like you know new new friends here to eat me to eat meat it's just how exciting yes oh grady and the lenses Gradient lenses. Hmm. Really? Well, I wonder what that is. I will find out. And, um, yeah, that might help. <laughs> You're getting to the age. Oops, 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 oops. Excuse me. Okay. I'm just gonna check with my suit how it's going on. Ooh, looks so nice, do you think? Just so looks great. Wow. Wow. Okay. Mmm, so nice. Oh, yes. Turned out to be very, very nice. Okay. Well, it, once if you make it, this is gonna last on a few days. So, you know, when you just come back home, and you're tired, you just heat it up, and then you can enjoy it. So, this is good. I'm just going to taste it now. Hmm. Wow. 
Wow, <laughs> this is so delicious. Yes, I think because of this, like a number of the vegetables, just so many. Wow, wow, this is like unexpected taste. So it's very mild, very soft taste, but so deep. <laughs> so great. Wow. And then you can have like forever, really. Mmm. Mmm. Oishi. Hi, Patty. Murakami. Hello. Hello. Today I'm making vegetable soup. And it's almost done. This is just so yummy. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna put the lid, put back the lid, lid on the pan. Then, um, final, um, okay, I'm just gonna clean this up. Excuse me. Okay, to get ready for this, letters. Letters. Ready for this rest? You just going to cut this is letters like roughly, roughly, like that. This is just fine. That's it. It might be a bit too much, but. This is it. Good, good, good. Okay, so I think it didn't really take that much, like 10 minutes. It's been 10 minutes, right? So. Okay. I think that the soup is ready. Let's dish up. Doesn't it look nice? Well, I think I will cook it a little more later on, but just just for now. Because I want to taste it. really gorgeous soup uh, 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 uh. then the topping <laughs> when you eat it dip the lettuce then it's it's like a half cut and a half rub. This is how I eat it. Ta da! Oishiso. I know you can't really see the um soup inside, but I'm just gonna put a little bit. See? Ta -da! This is like a itadakimasu time, right? Yes, 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 yes. 
yes. Okay. いただきます。Oh, this looks better than what you had for your dinner. いただきます。Okay. So, when you eat it, just mix with the, the, the letters. Then it's like a half cooked and then half raw. いただきます。うんうんうんうん。うん。うん。I love it. Mmm. 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 That's right. A lot of vegetables. Look. It's so good for you. Mmm. Mmm. おいしいよおいしいよおい<咳>、うん、しいおいしい,おい,しい I think the result of adding this potatoes if you really really cook like Sigrid Sato, hello, hello, hello. Are you from Germany? My goodness, hello. Ah. Good morning, thank you. I was actually making、um, a vegetable soup today and to clean your fridge up.、Um, yes, your children would love to have this, and then this would be just so great for your children, kids. So much nutrition.、Uh, maybe if your kids like to have it, then just not add the wine or anything. Oh, hello, Mikey in Vegas. Hello. Oh, hi, 06 IG Satana. Oh, dear. Your name is just so not long. Oh, thank you. This is just so delicious. But I mean, if you really cook long, very long time, the potato obviously is going to melt. So that taste is, I'm mean, not taste, but the, the texture must, it's going to be very, very thick. But if you wouldn't cook that long enough, then, then this is just so fine to have this potato in the soup. I would prefer it. That's the kind of result. Mmm. 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 Yes, do me. Mmm. Oh, I see. It's a Belenese name. That's why the, your name is long. Never mind. I'm sorry I can't say it like a whole thing, but I'm just so happy to see you. Thank you. Yes, so、um, now. Pumpkin. I mean, you can enjoy so many vegetables here. So I love it. And then you don't need anything else, really. This is just good enough. I mean, look, so much vegetables. And I feel like, you know, if you are a beans lover, then oishi, oishi. Yes.、Um, if you're like a beans lover, you should put. Some of the beans in it that would help too, but otherwise, I mean, this is just great enough, really. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. <clears throat> It's so hot.、Mm. Yeah, and um. Yes, this is really, really enough. Oh, broken spaghetti. Yes, maybe. That's good. That's a good idea, too. Yes, then in that way, I think you should put more of taste. 
like condiments. Maybe I should put, I don't know what, what I should do. Maybe if you can just put a tin of um, tomatoes, that's going to help as well. And maybe if you want to have like a spaghetti with it, then add some, you know, some of the uh, ketchups and stuff like that. But, um, yeah, but uh, this is just good enough for just enjoying as soup. So, I mean, yes, you can actually use this soup to anything, like with anything. So, I think this is very, very useful. You know, you just, just cut the vegetables as you watch TV or are listening to the radio, you know, whatever you have time, then, then put it in the pan, stir fry a little bit and add a little bit of liquid. Just let it cook and then it's going to be done in like half an hour. So that's great, isn't it? Mmm. 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 Mm -mm. Yeah, you can put it in rice, you know, anything, anything goes with it. It's great. Or maybe like, mm, I don't know what else. Mm, anything. I was just thinking of like a, adding like a mochi, like when you like cut like a like a piece dice of the mochi and then put it in there and then that's gonna be like a really really um fully nice dinner tofu mm, yeah that would do too yes you have all the ideas so you know if you get like all the ideas together and then that's gonna be great recipe mm. 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 I think the recipe today went out frozen tofu? Really? Frozen tofu? I see. You have frozen tofu. I wonder if you froze it, what's going to happen? Mm. How about the nutrition? Yes, I think you can do that because every time I boil the, the, the soy beans, then because I don't, I can't use it all, all in one go. So I, I just um, froze it to keep it. So I think frozen tofu would work too. I think so too. Well, I think the recipe today Oh, it turned into like a sponge? Oh, I see. <laughs> but that's okay. As long as so healthy. Yes, I think so. Yes, as long as you enjoy it, that would be just great. So, um, yes, I think that the recipe today actually turned out to be great too. I think I'm just so happy with it. How about you guys? Are you, did you enjoy it? I mean, I hope this I hope this recipe helps your dinner or your um, everyday everyday recipes. Great. Okay. Well, I will. I'm actually thinking because I have I have potato left. Actually, I have one more potato, like a whole thing. So um. I am planning to have, um, oh, hi, Lady Mist, hello, Ooh, great, great to see you. Um, I was thinking to make a potato, potato, potato garret. That's what I was thinking for the next live stream. So that's going to be like really, really easy. Wouldn't take that much time. It's going to be potato garret. So it's like a crepe kind of thing. So um, yes, please enjoy this um, hot, hot soup, vegetable soup for this very cold weather. Yes, yes, you're right. Thank you so much. Well, 
I think that this Porsche is really demanding to say goodbye to you. Okay, Porsche's out. Oh, okay, so it was great to see you all. Thank you so much. Thank you. I really appreciate your time. Thank you very much. And oh my god. Okay, okay, say, say goodbye to everyone. Nice to see you. Okay, thank you so much. Thank you. So I will see you next week again. Making the potato gut. Okay, thank you so much. Aloha. Bye bye, everyone. Thank you. Stay safe and take care of yourself. Great. Bye bye. Thank you for your. Time. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Good night.